Hi, I'm Mayanna Wick, and I'm the driver of a 1996 IndyCar. It's a Lola chassis, and it has a small block, 400 cubic inch IndyCar. It runs about 800 horsepower. We have been preparing for here at Coda for two years now in this IndyCar. We have been training at tracks, getting me up to speed, getting me used to the car. Just to get here for Coda, we spent about a week just purely packing, getting our semi ready and prepped. It takes a lot of work just to get here. So I am doing a lot of sponsorship work, sponsorship satisfaction up to this point. So I do a lot of events, a lot of meet and greets with fans. And then we're getting our money to work for us while we're here. We get promotional um, applications while we're here. We get uh, great footage, which is provided by Go and MS. And we also have things provided from us before we even get here, like fuel, which is provided by Master Petroleum in Lazier, Colorado. And this is a, a hometown company that's supporting me all the way out here in Texas. Preparing for a race, there's a lot of maintenance that goes into it on the crew's part of the team. They have to make sure that the car is race ready. This means that there needs to be no oil leaks, no fuel leaks. It means that when we get the car running, that everything, all the pressures, all the temperatures are correct. So even when I come off of a session, before the next session, they're instantly checking about uh, tires. A tire, one individual tire on the Indy car could be different temperatures in that individual tire. And that tells them whether the tire needs to have more camber or less camber. So you have to have more maintenance on that from the crew after a race before the next event. You also have to be making sure that the engine is running properly, that everything is working properly in the steering console, in um, the axles, in the A-arms. Everything has to be working perfectly for this car to do well. So we have to tune it for tire compound. We have to decide whether we're using Avons or Goodyears. We have to decide what compound of slicks we want to use, whether it's super soft or just soft. And we have to decide the communication and get that honed in, the communication between crew chief, engineer, and driver. Once we're here and we get on track, it's about learning the track. What's the fastest line? What apexes are best? Uh, getting the throttle honed in on these Indy cars so that it's best for me to drive with. The Lord Jesus Christ is a huge part of who I am. I, I love him with all of my heart. And even though I race, uh, my main goal here is to be a great missionary for Christ. I want to be that shining light to people, the, the even-tempered driver that comes off of the track, and even if they had a rough day, that everybody else sees the light in them still. And that if there's a bigger picture behind the scenes, that there is a bigger reason that I'm still smiling. And that's the biggest reason that I'm here at the racetrack. I really want to thank all of my fans for all of their love and support. This whole weekend and before this weekend, you guys have been so awesome. I've been getting so many messages from you guys, so many awesome comments of just being supportive for me. And I want you guys just to know that that support just grows my passion for this sport. And it just makes me so encouraged and have so much momentum going into the day that I just drive better with all of your love and support. And I just, I can't thank you enough. Go ahead and link me up on Instagram or Facebook. It's just Mayanna with Racing. And that is M-I-A-N-N-A-W-I-C-K Racing. And uh, I would love to talk with you, connect with you, and grow that relationship.